Uh, we're meeting with the realtor this afternoon, honey, but he said that you don't have to be there. Mr. Williams is with someone. He's busy. I said you can't. Uh, Jim Gross, Mr. Williams, from the Genoa City Chronicle. Look, Mr. Gross, I... There's a story out. I'd like your statement for a follow-up. I, I, I don't... Word is there's a problem with the disbursement of funds. Just stop it right now. I'm not going to discuss whatever it is you want to talk about. I'm in the middle of something, as you can see. So you get the hell out of my office, or I'm going to throw you out. Don't say I didn't try. Paul, I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Forget it, Lynn. What was that all about? What did um, he want? Um, you know how reporters are. They're just, they're just trying to dig up some dirt. Well, he seemed to have something quite definite on his mind. He was really anxious to talk to you. Well, look, I just as soon not get into it. Honey, I have the feeling that whatever's upsetting you has something to do with what that reporter heard. Can't we talk about what we were talking about before, okay? A new house. That's fine. Dear Lord, Paul. That's it, isn't it? I don't know what you're talking about. Well, that man said something about a problem with the disbursement of funds. That Cassandra's, it's Cassandra's estate, isn't it? The inheritance, there's a problem with it. All right. You're going to find out about it anyway. Yes, there is a problem with the inheritance. I didn't get the estate. What? Why not? I don't understand. Because Cassandra and Brad's divorce was never finalized, so Brad gets everything. Oh, oh, Paul, I'm so sorry. Uh, look, uh, I'll get hold of Mrs. Rexford right away and, and, uh... I'll explain to her about the house. I hope she understands. She'll have to understand. We're not moving after all. There's no money. No money. There sure as hell is money. I'll get it somewhere. I want you to have that house. No, no, honey, I can't. No, I won't, I won't let you. Please. I promised you a house, and I want you to have a house. Please. Would you let me do this for you? It's really important to me. For God's sakes, let me salvage something positive out of this.